If there was one thing we all unanimously hate, it would be boredom. Every day we're finding new ways to distract ourselves, spice up our lives, and make our lives more exciting. But what if I told you that being boring was the secret to an exciting life? I'm the Unspecialist and this is a video about why exciting lives require boring routines. My initial statement may sound counterintuitive, and rightfully so. A better way to express it would be to say that boring routines are the foundation for exciting lives. Now why would that be? It's simply because we have a million little things that are routine, necessary, and even important that we have to do in our daily lives. However, we tend to either overcomplicate them or try to make tasks that should be routine and boring exciting when we should just leave them as they are. One of the best examples of things that we overcomplicate is eating. Despite knowing deep down that food primarily is for nourishment, we tend to focus on consuming food for pleasure. How many times have you heard someone say, oh my gosh, I ate that yesterday. I don't want to eat the same thing again today. And it's understandable, eating the same thing every day is boring. However, we tend to waste a lot of time, effort, and even money trying to eat something new, different, or exciting every day. And if it's not about eating something different or exciting every day, it's wasting time choosing what to eat, when to eat, where to eat. You can map this pattern of wastage to virtually any other daily task. Waking up, getting dressed, going to work, coming home, cleaning, going to bed. And if you look at the time that you may waste in each of these tasks, it adds up. Ultimately, it leads to us feeling like we're not accomplishing enough with our days, we're not doing anything interesting enough, and it suddenly makes the day feel a lot more tedious, a lot more boring. Boring not because of what tasks we do, but how we do them, because everything I just listed are things that we all have to do. However, the idea is to get these daily tasks simplified to a point where you don't have to waste time thinking about them or waste time in the execution. In a nutshell, you save time on the small things so that you have more time for the big things. If you manage to successfully simplify one, a few, or all of the tasks that I mentioned, you'll find that you give your brain more freedom to be creative and tackle bigger problems. And then you will have more time to do more interesting and exciting things. In short, you're reducing the amount of time you spend doing things that you have to do so that you have more time to do everything that you want to do. For a more personal example, I can share how I simplified my weekday meals while at university. Essentially, what I did was, I had the same breakfast each weekday, the same lunch each weekday, and the same dinner each weekday. This simple adjustment saved time during meal prep, it made shopping a lot quicker and cheaper, and it made it a lot simpler to choose when to eat. Now if you look at this whole adjustment, it actually saved me several hours per week. And that's just one adjustment. Imagine the impact if you made adjustments to all the other things and activities that I listed prior. Now, I know this adjustment, eating the same thing every day, may seem a bit daunting to some of you viewers, but I hope that the benefits give you something compelling to consider. I will address this topic later on in subsequent videos, however I do hope that this particular video was useful to you. What are some simple things that you tend to overcomplicate in your daily life? What about boring routines? Have you incorporated any lately? Let me know down in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more content in the future. This is The Unspecialist saying, exciting wouldn't feel so good if it wasn't for boring. Peace.